Hello and welcome back. I have some really fun comparison for you this afternoon. So finally, I got my 58 millimeter, uh, uh, the BT wedge from San Antonio Industry. So now we can do the proper uh, comparison between we got San Antonio Industry versus OCD. Okay, it's gonna be fun. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys the complete unboxing uh, uh, experience for you guys. Uh, so let's take a look. Okay, what I'm gonna do is. They look like my picture quality is fine this afternoon. So, so I have my computer set up to the side here so I can see all your questions if you have any comments. So uh, by the way, if you haven't pressed like on this video, make sure to do so right now. And also if you haven't subscribed, make sure to do it. So let's get going, okay? Let's get going here. I got my both wedge, BT wedge, and then OCD. Okay, so let me give you guys a little background on the San Antonio industry, the BT wedge. So, so this BT wedge is designed by the gentleman from Korea. So he got inspired by OCD. So, and he kind of like tweak it a little bit. So now he come up with this design. So, and yeah, so OCD is the original. Okay, so um, that, that's by far that is the, this is the original. Okay, if someone say, I mean, this is not, this is it. Okay, so this is the original here. And then San Antonio Industry, the wedge is more like, kind of like the younger brother of OCD. Uh, so, you know, let's give you guys a close look. Okay, it's gonna be really fun. Uh, I can't wait to share with you guys. I'm just gonna tweak my videos here, my channel. Let me, hold on, here we go. Hopefully I can give you guys a close up there. Good, perfect. So let's start with, you know what? Let's start with OCD, okay? Comes to unboxing experience, yeah, both fantastic. By the way, I'm gonna show you another one. So this is, I got from Amazon, okay, $15. I think 15 or $20 I got from Amazon. Very similar to a wedge from San Antonio Industry. So this is the $15. So you guys can see a lot of Chinese knockoffs around uh, in the market right now. But again, if you guys are looking for something cheaper options, you could spend about 15 to 20 bucks for this is 58 millimeter as well. Okay. Let's start with OCD. So OCD is different version. So this is the version three. So this is the latest model. They give you a nice brochure. Again, they give you a nice uh, micro cloth. So they recommend every like 10th use, 10 times, you, know, you might want to polish it because the one fault, okay? One downside of using OCD is that whenever you use it, you're gonna see some clumps to the side. But again, they are tiny, okay? So it's not even, it's not even big deal, but you know, sometimes it can be annoying. You know, you expect a clean uh, bottom, but sometimes it doesn't. But again, uh, looks very clean design there. Obviously you can adjust up or down. And also as you can, hopefully you guys can, I can show you guys, has a numbering system there as well. You know, that's the, seven eight nine it has a different numbering system so you know you can keep track of you know what number you used the last time okay and overall okay as you can see it's not it's a little shaky okay it's not as tight as you know what I'm, we're gonna get to San Antonio industry okay I love the design of it I mean, this is obviously fantastic. It's been proven, but you know what? Let's go with San Antonio Industry. Again, comes with this nice canister here. The, uh, I'm sorry, we are, um, this is a levy. Hold on a second. I'm looking for wedge. Yep, so this is the levy. This is more like palm. 
Let me grab the right one. So this is actually, it's called Block Party from San Antonio Industry, actual set. So this is the wedge, okay? So this one, we are comparing with this one. Okay, here we go. Comes to unboxing experience, both fantastic there as well. So this one, okay, I have to show you this. So there is an option to add, it's called uh, Bachman, uh, the Accu system. So there is a numbering system here. Hopefully I can show you guys close up here. Close up. So here's our zero point, as you can see. I'm gonna loosen out the top, and then you can increase to the counterclockwise, you can up your numbering system. So now you have different dial. You can be very, very precise. So let's compare these two, okay? Let's comes to beer quality, you know what I have to give to San Anthony industry for sure. They are well made, very tight, tight fit compared to OCD. Some are loose, okay. It's loose there. It doesn't feel like the premium as San Anthony industry. So, I mean, we are paying a lot of money for this, folks. So, because I want to be feel like the premium quality, but you know, let's weight this. Let's see how heavy this thing is. I got my scale. So, let's just start with the OCD. It's about 386 gram, okay, for OCD. With the San Antonio industry, about four, uh, 544 grams. So it's a, almost 200 gram heavier than OCD. So again, it comes to beer quality, I have to give to San Antonio industry, the BT wedge. But here's big but though. But the real question is how it's gonna perform, okay? comes to making espresso or making coffee. So that's all about, okay? This is all about what kind of quality of shot you're gonna get. So, okay, hold on a second. Let me flip it over. Again, I mean, we're not talking about, you know, $20, $30 tools. And we are talking, so hold on. Maybe I can show you guys the actual price on it. That's the great thing about having a computer right next to me. So BT Wedge selling for 149, okay, from the website, San Anton Industry. And then let's go to OCD. <laughs> also, OCD is uh, selling for 149 as well from uh, uh, Seattle Copy Gear. So it's about the same price range. And then, so this one actually uh, added another $20 uh, dollars for the Bachman AccuDrive, the numbering system for another 20, but I mean, that's definitely optional. You don't have to have that, but you know, it's nice to have, okay? So we are talking about $150 each. Comes to beer quality wise, you know, I was a little disappointed when I bought this. So this one, actually I bought it, okay? I bought for my own money as well. But this one, uh, this is sent by the San Antonio industry. Uh, they want me to review it because I've been using 54 millimeter for years. I love that product. So, so finally, you know, I asked them to send me this one to review. So they actually sent me one to review on. Comes the big quality. There's no comparison, okay? Beer quality wise, San Antonio industry is much, much better. Okay, I have to say, but 
for uh, maybe next couple weeks or so, I'm going to be try both on. So when I'm making uh, coffees, and then I'm going to do a separate video on this one. Comes to shot quality, okay? Is our shot quality is OCD versus the uh, wedge? The fact is, I use both of them. Uh, I, I've been using wedge for a long time on my 54 millimeter uh, Braber espresso machine. But with the OCD, I've been using for the last couple of months using my Rancheria Servia as well. So, I mean, both works great, okay? The real question is, is it really worth 150 bucks? So, I, I think that's the, you know, if you guys are watching this, that's something you guys want to find out as well. Is it better than $15? distribution tool from Amazon. So this one is uh, Amazon brand, 15 bucks. So this is OCD, okay. Looks very similar with a different design on the back. But, so this is the design by the, you know, World Brista Champion. Sasha actually designed this. He won the Brista Championship on, what, 2015, I believe. But this is a more like knockoff uh, Chinese brand for the wedge, BT wedge. So again, uh, you know, let's find out next couple of weeks. Okay, I'll be really looking forward to share that with you. Is there any difference between even $15 ones? It's gonna be a good comparison, okay? When it comes to like, you know, user experience, I mean, look and feel, I think I have to give it to uh, BT wedge. Let's see here. I'm gonna look at some question from you guys. Uh, they are both like kind of stainless steel. I'm very heavy though, okay? And then what else here? And then I have some, uh, OCD is like, uh, I think aluminum. I'm not sure exactly, but yeah. But you know, it's, again, it's pretty heavy, but BT wedge is heavier. Uh, this is definitely stainless steel for sure. Okay, so let's see, uh, $128, OCD is 128 on 8 ounce coffee right now, according to uh, Heather Choi. Okay, thank you for that. All right, let's see here. So I think we are pretty good. This, the, this, uh, I mean, I, by the way, I have, you guys like this video, okay? I think the, the reason why I like to do more live streaming, because you get to see it. I mean, you, you get to see the entire unboxing experience in live. And uh, again, if you haven't liked this video, make sure to press like. If you haven't subscribed, I'll do it right now. Uh, I hope you guys are having a wonderful Saturday afternoon. And then uh, next, again, uh, next coming weeks, uh, I'm going to make a separate video on this one. Okay, I'm going to make a separate video. We are going to compare BT Wedge versus OCD. So is there any difference? Okay, or just the brand, just the brand name, or just the design, I'm not sure. But in the end, okay, in the end, it's all about making better coffee at home, so. Let's find out for that, huh? let's see. Uh, Kelly Morgan say, yeah, crema is only about 45 bucks, 40, 45 dollars, so. Well, you guys have a lot of options. If you guys, especially if you guys in the 58 millimeter uh, range, Man, there's a, uh, you have a lot more options. You, got, you can get a $10 distribution tool up to $150. And if you want to spend more money, uh, another company makes another distribution tool. They're selling for $250. So it's all depends on how much money you guys want to spend. So, so this is, we are talking about just the distribution tool, okay? And then there is a temper as well. So, uh, so next coming uh, weeks, we're gonna be uh, setting up properly. It's called the force temper. Okay, the force temper is also fantastic as well. We are going to do the unbox and we are going to close look at this one. And then not only that, we are going to compare that with, I got my uh, another temper here. So this is one from Barry Brista. Uh, also great as well and so this is the Rancheria Servia. Whenever you buy a coffee machine, the Rancheria Servia they used to give uh, plastic ones. Now they actually give us the actual temper. Okay, so you got this. 
So this is another one here, another temper, and also we are going to compare that with first temper, and also I'm getting another one. So next couple weeks as well. So we are, we are going to compare about four different types, and then we are going to take a look at that side by side. So we are going to, yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be a lot of fun comparing it again. It's, it's, not, it's, up, it's not about the tools, okay? In the end, you know what, can we make a better shot? The fact is, these tools help us make better shots, but if you have good techniques and, you know, only thing you might need is just the temper, okay? Anyway, I hope you guys like this video, and then I'm going to see you guys next time.